you got it. Jerk. Oh, bro. Huge, bro. You know how to drive this thing. Holy sh Holy sh What the f Y'all drinking already? It's a giant. Hello and welcome. What's up, everybody? Thank you for clicking on the video. We caught a 9.5 in the last video. Top my PB. We're picking things up right where we left off. This is going to be a multi-day bed fishing mission out there with my boy Teacock on the Tower of Power. We're going to keep things rolling. You're going to see multiple days. I'm going to try to keep you guys updated the best I can as we roll through the video as to what's going on. I'll throw some notes up on the screen. And you guys know a day on the water with me would not be complete without something crazy happening. So make sure you watch all the way to the end. But this right here is going to be an amalgam of all the awesome bed fishing that we have done over the past couple weeks. This is the most fun that I've ever had bed fishing and the most success that I've ever had as well when it comes to size and numbers. Enjoy the ride and I'll see you guys back in here once we get done catching some dragons. Also, happy to report that every one of these fish that you're gonna see was immediately weighed, photographed, and released right at the bed site. Enjoy. We've located another giant. Let's see if we can get her in the boat. We're about to fish for her. We've just been scouting all morning. The wind's finally calming down. We're getting a little bit of light. We found some freaking megas. We got like three or four located that are in that 10 pound range. So we're gonna try to make it happen today. Nine and a half yesterday. Can you see her though? She's, got, she's on the very back going mm -hmm. like this. In between the flat rock and this one on that side. If you look behind. Now you see oh, her. Oh, I see her. Yep, I see her. Your deal is going to be having to set the hook and bring her out here. The good news is she really can't dive that far under the boat because of these rocks. Man, I'm trying to play this in my head, this this fish landing. I'm not worried about any of this except for that right there. Flip up there. I mean, when she turns, I'm going to see her. I don't know. Can you see the white spot in the middle of that rock? Okay. What? I'm going to chunk way past. No. Uh -uh. But behind that? Behind it and to the right. It's not a big bed. Yeah. You check your line. Make sure you don't catch the buck. I don't think you're going to have a problem. Let it fall. She's coming from the right. Twitch it. You're right underneath her. If it disappears, nope, nope, nope. Wait. Okay, hold on. Then she's just grabbing it and shaking it. Well, no, no, no. She had it. That was her again. No, uh -huh. no. She just ate it. I didn't see it disappear all the way, though. No, she uh, she literally just ate it. When you started reeling this, she spit it out. It was gone. What? Yeah. Okay. Son of a... It's hard to see. Oh, she's on Twitch it. it. She had it. She's pecking it. I can't tell what's going on, bro. I see She's the covering the bait. You gotta pop it a little bit harder. She's got it. Jerk. It's strong as shit. Another good one, dude. Yeah. Heck yeah, bro. All right, then. Not a bad fish at all. Yeah. All right. We'll take it. You started with that? Yeah. That's the way to start the day right there. She's not as big as we thought she was, but that's still nice, healthy dragon. Awesome. Heck yeah, dude. That was fun. She was strong, dude. Oh, yeah. She dude. was strong. First one on the day. We got her to eat. She's probably six-ish, maybe. Yeah. Something like that. We're gonna let her go. It's not the kind we're after, but still a really fun fish to catch. Beautiful, clear water. Look at that dragon. Thanks for the fight, girl. Go do your thing. That girl. So we knocked the dust off. We got one in the boat and we've got several others that size are bigger located. So we're gonna keep fishing. That wasn't a DD, but she looked freaking huge. We found some others that are bigger than that. So we're gonna keep grinding. That ain't old girl, but that still got me amped up, bro. That was still fun. Showed her who's the boss. That fish was strong. If that fish had been 10 pounds, that would have been a deal. <laughs> that would have been a deal because that was a strong fish, dude. Still fun. That was, I was just about to say that. That was still a lot of fun, dude. Tower power. Pete and Heat Tour 2023. 
anytime Captain Ron ain't with us, that's that's what we're that's what we're going by from now on, dude. Pete and the Heat. Yesterday, we were out here and there was another boat. We kind of got close to him and the guy said, "What's up, Heater?" And then he said, "What's up, Travis?" And then when we left, Travis said, "That dude called me Peter." And I said, "No." Nah. He said, "What's up, Heater?" Travis said, "Oh, that makes sense." Can we just hop on? You want to see if that one will go down? Yeah, let me pull that panel off real quick. Dang, dang, dang. I just put all this <laughs> up, bro. Why would it work on the pump and not anywhere else? Oh, yeah. I didn't even think about that. I don't even know. I can't remember how to do that. I have to look that up. That's a duh. That's a duh, Teacock. Dude, I freaking banged the rock on that way. I beached my boat over there. Backing out, dude. It dipped, the back end dipped and it's straight. Clunk. But then when I was talking to you on the phone, I was like, oh, dude, there's two. There was one. There was a giant come swimming out right here. They big, though. That's not even, actually, that's, a, that's the buck. That's not even the big one. I think she's up here. Oh, okay. What's this one right here? That's why I said there was two of them. Yeah, I knew there was right. two there of them. There are two of them. You know how to drive this thing? Holy <laughs> shit. Holy <laughs> shit. What the? Oh, shit. Sorry. What the? Y'all drinking already? No, we don't drink. We're not drinking right now. Thank you. Don't hit that one either. We've cut two tens off this one bed. Watch. I don't know if they're ten pounders. They're there's some big ones though. If you feel her swimming with it. Yeah, I got you. Cause I think she might have had it. I can't tell for sure. She's all over that. She bed. is. She does not like it in there. Look at her. Oh, bro. Oh yeah, bro. Oh yeah, Teacock. She's huge, dude. She's huge. <laughs> oh, I don't know how big, but that's a big fish. Ah, uh, yeah. Probably seven-ish, maybe eight. That's a tank, though. So big. <laughs> Ooh, that was as good as it gets right there, dude. That other one's up there too, I think. Then we'll get pictures and all that shit. <laughs> That's a dragon. We're gonna let this one go. She's not what we're after. Still fun. Still fun. That was fun, dude. I think that's the bigger one. Yeah, you can see her right off the back of the bed, sideways. She's bright, but she's back there. Okay, yeah, she's up there. I see her now. All right. So do do the dang thing. Yeah, I think if she bites, swings. Okay. She's gonna bite, dude. She's already bit it. Let it fall. She got it. Oh, nope. she's so fast, she's, bro. She's got it, but it's not gone. Okay, got you. She's just carrying it. Because she grabbed it and went this way. I could see it running through the water. Yeah, carried it off the back. Oh my God. She came off, bro. Hold on one sec. She'll come back. You didn't pull her off. I was sitting there, I didn't see it, and then like I was turning a dock corner and it hit, and then my boat just hit the side and it hit the raft. I was like, all right, cool, it's not doing anything. And I guess there was like a nail in it. Oh, and that'll grabbed do it. it. Got the fiberglass, it just uh, made me sick, dude. Okay. And this little bed is hurt. Yeah, I just want to see if she'll pull up here real fast. We ain't gonna spend too much time on her. She's not, I mean, she's a good fish. But if she was to pull up there and just catch her real fast. Hopefully we can at least get redemption on that one out there. Oh yeah, that's definitely a much bigger fish. Oh yeah, and there's the buck right with her too again. Okay. That bed's farther back than where you just pitched. That bed's right there at the grass line. She's already going for it. Yeah. There we go. 
That's more like it. <laughs> yeah, that'll work. Oh yeah, dude. Awesome. I only have one camera rolling on that one, but she was fighting, dude. Heck yeah, dude. That was awesome. That'll get you warmed up and woke up. That's a, that's another one to the sweep, dude. Thanks for the fight. That was awesome. Go do your thing. I'm solid chunk cut. A solid chunk cut. Man, I gotta tell you, Teacock, this has been the best week of fishing. You see her sitting out on the bed? She's hard to see because of the wind right now. She's oh, like yeah, this. I got eyes on her. Give me a lift this trolling motor. You good. Good. She did not like Ooh. that shit. She's circling right back. Here she comes. Oh, I felt it. Yeah, yeah. She, oh, she flared like, but well, I can still see your okay, bait. Okay, all right. Throw it a little bit more to the left. She turned. This is huge, bro. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> You're not quite there. Not quite there, but hey, she's big, dude. <laughs> oh, she looked bigger than has. She's not dark. Not quite oh, there. Yeah. Oh my god, <laughs> bro! I thought that was the one, but hey, that's still a freaking giant, dude. Yeah, dude. That's still a giant. Absolute beauty unit. That's a gorgeous animal. All right, there's a look at that one. Freaking tank. We're gonna let her go. Thanks for the fight, girl. That was awesome. Let's get a good release shot on this fish, Teacock. Let her go back. See ya. That's a dragon, dude. Look at that fish. Awesome. <laughs> Teacock! <laughs> My man. That was freaking awesome. Oh, man. She was hot, too. Yeah. That's how you want them right there, bro. That, I mean, That's what I'm saying. These fish out here. When they're locked, they're locked. Another unit. I don't know how many fish you guys have seen me catch so far. How many days we've rolled through in this video. It's been a lot, but we're back out here. Bed fishing day 36. We got another one locked up. We're going to try to get her. That's the update. Let's give it a flip. See what the bait looks like. I guess. Should be able to see it. Oh boy, she thumped it, bro. She sure did her. No. Well, I, well, there's not really a way to tell. She's definitely on it. She's on it. She's on it. She have it? No. So hard to tell, but I feel like I can see her moving down there. I definitely could on that first flip, 100%. Uh, it looked like her head was right where I would imagine my bait to be, like based on where I'm trying to drop it into that bed. Yeah. And she showed up like soon after I dropped too. Good. She's not huge, but she's a good fish. That's a good one. <laughs> That's a solid dude. Heck yeah. Get me warmed up. Make sure I still can know how to swing on one. <laughs> That's a six. Full too. She is full. Hey, you know I know how to hold one, Teacock. Yeah. All right. Thanks for the fight, girl. Go do your thing. Drop them off. Nice. When fun. you set the hook and you went like this, I was like, oh. Shit. She was definitely strong. <laughs> she did not move at first. All right. That's not the one we're after, but that's a nice fish, and that's a really good fish for a lot of people. Mm -hmm. 
fourth quarter Hail Mary. Hail Mary cut. Swim bait. I'm going to try it. I'm going to say if uh, that swim bait disappears, it's her. Because that buck didn't look like he could do much. It's so dark around the rock. Right, she could be just out on the outside of it. There she is. Oh God. She's, oh, already, she's already on it. It's a giant. It's a giant. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> It is a big fish. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> yes, sir. Well, when she jerk on Teacock like that, that's how you know. That's a freaking She's dragon. heavy, too. She is heavy. Oh, my gosh. That right there, boys, is a dragon. Awesome. She bit quick. Look at that fish, dudes. Epic. <laughs> that's fun, dude. Yeah. Zeros on the scale. That's a thick Vicky right there, boys. <laughs> Eight eleven. Eight eleven. Eight eleven. Right at almost nine. That's an eight eleven to end the journey. Nice fish, dude. Let's let her go, Teacock. That was fun. This fish was strong. Absolute dragon. Get down there real close, brother. See ya. <laughs> yes. Teacock. Another one. <laughs> Keep add another one to the list. Falls victim to Pete and Heach. That took that was that first flip? Yeah, I think so. I think that was first flip in I there, seen dude. Fall up down there. And then flare, I was like, oh, I seen your line jump. Oh, that picture is bad, dude. Yeah, send me. Because I'm gonna make a big post. Yeah, I got you, bro. Anything you need. That was bad, dude. <laughs> Come out here and add a 6.9 and an 8.11 to an already extraordinary day. Yeah. And there that was, guys. Multi-day bed fishing adventure out there on top of the Tower of Power with my boy Teacock. You guys check out Captain Teacock's fishing tours. He's a good friend of mine and he's an amazing fishing guide, excellent teacher, knows a lot about bed fishing and a lot about fishing in general. Dude is an absolute hammer. He's taught me a lot and I always have a good time out there on the boat with Teacock. Thank you. If you're watching for getting me out there and helping me catch those bed fish man that tower that tower really comes into play it's such an advantage you can see so much more aboard the tower of power than you can from even on like you know something smaller that you're standing up on top of like a cooler which we've done in the past but that tower gives you a real advantage enables you to see uh, a lot further it gives you some great visibility but would not have been able to see those fish at all if it weren't for my waterland polarized optics that i was wearing while i was out there you guys check out waterlandco.com and use jr15 for 15 percent off your own pair of polarized fishing lenses waterland the best shades in the game they just dropped the new bed fishers so go check them out man also want to give a massive thank you and shout out to six cents fishing the six cents sweep let me show you guys the setup I was catching these fish with. Is this bad Larry right here? This one did all the damage, the sweep. I actually took that one that I was using off and saved it because it got so rashed up and thrashed up. This is a newer one, but I got that mojo on that bait that we caught all those fish on in this video. Texas rig style ADOT owner beast hook, a couple beads, three quarter ounce pitch black tungsten, pegged sensory series, seven, seven heavy fast, Shimano Corrado 150 DC, 20 pound fluorocarbon. 7.4 to 1 on the gear ratio and that was it dragons in the boat man i had a blast out there catching these fish and i hope you enjoyed riding along with me i know this video was kind of like bounce we kept it rolling we bounced through some multiple days i was out there with teacock for well over a week catching these fish and we saw some fish that we were unable to catch that were absolute giants and actually dwarfed a lot of the fish that you saw in this video so still on the mission still trying to get that dd but that 
is for another day, another story, and another video. If you guys are interested in checking out that bait or that rod and you want to catch some dragons yourself, check out SixSenseFishing.com and use my code JR10 at checkout to save 10% off everything on the website. Shout out to the JR10 Army. I could not do this without you guys. If you order something with my JR10 code, please take a screenshot of your order confirmation and DM it to me on Instagram at the Justin Royal so that I can give you a shout out. Also, massive thank you and much love to the Almighty Heater Army. Those are the names that you're gonna see roll across the screen here at the end of the video. If you're interested in getting your name on that list and becoming immortalized here on the channel, check out that top link down below in the video description. Learn more about how you can become a Heater Army member yourself. I appreciate you all for taking time out of this day to watch your video, but that's about all I got for you today. That about does it. That about wraps her on up. So I'm gonna say goodbye for now, but I will see you on the next one. <laughs>